A lock of hair found 90 years ago in the gold fields of Western Australia has turned out to be DNA gold for scientists. It's providing key evidence about how the first humans colonised the planet 70,000 years ago. Using the hair, scientists have mapped the DNA history of Aboriginal Australians and found they're the direct descendants of the first modern humans to leave Africa. This lock of hair has rewritten the history of human migration. It was taken from a young Aboriginal man near Kalgoorlie in the 1920s and scientists have used the DNA to map the origins of the first Australians. We find in fact evidence that Aboriginal Australians diversified from other populations much, much earlier than what people previously thought, about 70,000 years ago. The research, published in the international journal Science, debunks the common theory that all modern humans migrated in a single wave out of Africa. Instead, the scientists believe descendants of Aboriginal Australians left first, followed by a second group of humans who would eventually settle in Europe and Asia. Aboriginal Australians are descending from the first human explorers. I mean, these are the guys that went into unknown land while my ancestors and Asian ancestors were hanging around somewhere in Africa or in, in the Middle East. It's the first time scientists have mapped an Aboriginal genome and say the research shows Indigenous Australians were not only the first humans to settle here, but they're also one of the oldest continuous cultures outside of Africa. For Aboriginal elder Ivan Forrest, it's a profound discovery. And this proves, and it proves to the rest of the world, that we were the first people here. We've been here for a long time and we're not going away. Scientists say the techniques used in the research will now be turned to study other Indigenous populations and their origins. Jane Norman, ABC News.